What's up, cooks? It's Wednesday. Today, we got something kind of special going on. We recently went to the Lodge factory outlet down near Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, and we had a great time. As you know, I was in my element around that store, and I got some goodies while I was there. So first, let's take a look at my little tour of the Lodge factory outlet, and um, we can check out what they have in there. So what's up? It's Wednesday. It's time for a tour of the Lodge factory outlet, as well as a haul. A few months ago, we were in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, doing a little shopping. This town has a lot of tourist attractions, including Dollywood, a lot of dinner theaters, and a lot of shopping. While we were there, we just happened to notice that they had a Lodge cast iron outlet. I think they have a few in the area. So you know me, I had to head into this store and see what they got going on. We are at the Lodge store. At the Little Pigeon River Overlook. That's what that is right it's, it's an overlook of the Little Pigeon River. Here. 
So wasn't that store cool? I can't wait to go back there again. I had a great time and they had some amazing things in there. So these are the things that I picked up while we were there. Um, I figured we would take a look at them. Um, we did go to the store a couple months ago and I've been sitting waiting to look at this stuff and I just haven't had a time. And now that it's Wednesday, I think it's time for that, right? So this is our first little package. And in here, we have some goodies. So the very first thing, this is not a large item, but they sell it there at the store. This is a silicone strainer and splatter screen. So this goes over the top when you're cooking something to keep stuff from splattering everywhere. Seems like when I cook, I get stuff all over this. And I really like this because it's silicone. I can drop this straight into the dishwasher. Yeah, and it just heat resistant to 500 degrees. So um, yeah, I'm really, really glad to have this. This is a Norpro um, silicone strainer, 12 and a half inches. So that's pretty cool. That's gonna fit, huh? Yeah. So it'll fit on a few nice size, uh, nice size pots. So I got a couple pieces of their ceramic ware. Um, because I love baking dishes. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> um, the very first thing is a square baker. Um, this is red like my uh, La Cruze. Um, oven safe to 450, dishwasher safe, century old uh, ceramic stoneware. So I got that piece as well as I got this oval piece. These are pretty cool. So we have all natural ceramic bakeware. This is eight by 11.75 inches. It's two and a, two and a half quart. So let's, let's unband this, right? This is really cool looking. I like, I love it how it's white on the inside. Um, this is awesome. I love this. And then we have the, um, square one. These are really cool with a little large uh, name in there. Awesome. I love them. So these are two pieces of ceramic. So you didn't know Lodge make ceramic, huh? They make cast iron, but they make these ceramic pieces. So this is an oval casserole. This one here is cast iron, and but this is enamel coated. So this is uh, similar to what we use with our, um, the stuff made in France, right? Um, let's see. So we have, since 1896, a large family has been making cast iron. Yay. This is too court. So let's see what we got here. Ooh, nice. Sweet. So this is large enamel. It is made in China, so it is like not the same as the stuff made in France, but it's also not as expensive. It's porcelain enamel on cast irons fired at 1200 to 1400 degrees. Hmm, interesting. So here is our piece. Wow, look at that. That is beautiful. <laughs> So it is light colored on the outside. It's gradient. And there's a couple little spots here that it's not enameled. So that's kind of interesting. Um, wow, look at this. So this is an au gratin. You could actually just use this as a regular roaster. Um, the same as any other. The same as these cast iron or these uh, ceramic, you can use this. But this is cast iron. And this is our final piece. This is a Dutch oven. It is enameled um, the same. It is a 4.5 enamel Dutch oven in lilac. That's why I got it, because I love the color. So let's see what we got. Woo, okay. We have the same um, manual. And ooh, look at the color. <gasps> ah! I haven't seen this color before, 
in these lodges. And when I saw this there, I was like, I got to get this. Ooh, I love it. Look at that purple color. Ooh, that is amazing. Look at that. It's little pieces here. Look at the color on that. Ooh, is that purple or what? I love it. Oh my gosh, I finally got a purple Dutch oven. Ooh, look at that baby. I love it, I love the color. That is amazing. So this too is an enameled uh, cast iron um, Dutch oven. You can make stews, you can stove top, you can put it in the oven, all that fun stuff. Hmm, I love it. So cooks, it's Wednesday and we have some new lodge pieces. I can't wait to make a stew in this. I think I'm gonna make my famous uh, uh, French onion soup in here. I'll leave a link down in there and up here to that recipe and it's perfect for this new uh, Dutch oven. So can't wait to use these pieces. Um, I hope you have a great week. It's Wednesday and we're almost there to the weekend. So hold on, right? And uh, we'll be able to cook again come this weekend, right? Um, I hope you have a great one. And if you like this video, please subscribe below. Leave me a comment and a like. And uh, go ahead and subscribe and hit that bell um, so you get notifications of our uploads. Also visit my website at amylearnstocook.com and you can catch me on social media at facebook.com slash groups slash amylearnstocook. I'm at Pinterest and Twitter at amylearnstocook and on Instagram I'm at cooking with Amy. Yay!